Hey there friends and good morning Papa. In today's video we're going after a very special hunter pet today. Meet Crystal Fang. This is honestly a really cool hunter pet because it's actually kind of like a rock running around keeping you company. Now a few things to note before we jump into the video that this is a rare spawn and it has a spawn timer approximately two and a half to three and a half hours. So if you come to this location and you don't see it you might have to wait a little bit. The other thing that needs to be noted is you need to be in the Beastmaster spec in order to tame Crystal Fang because it considered as an exotic hunter pet. Now with all of the formalities out of the way, let me show you where we're going. To get started, we're going to be in the Eastern Kingdoms and we're going to head over here to the Burning Steps. Once there, you want to locate Black Rock Mountain because we are heading inside. Once you've headed inside, you are going to want to make your way to the back area where the entrance is for the Black Rock Depths. Now, if you're not sure where to head for that, don't worry, I'm going to cover that in this video. You want to go ahead and fly inside the doorway to the Black Rock Mountain and just make your way into the center room right here. Then you want to go ahead and head down towards the bottom right here. You'll see an elf guy. Just ignore him. We don't care. We want to go into the room right here on the right. Head left. And then you are going to head all the way to the back part of this room. And that's where you'll end up finding Crystal Fang. Right here. So let's make our way back there. Once you've gotten to this location, you'll find Crystal Fang in a little coved area surrounded by three dwarves. Now I am coming down here on a level 60 hunter. That would make Crystal Fang level 30 along with everybody standing around him. I just targeted Crystal Fang and tamed him business as usual. Nothing special was required except for you do need to be in a Beastmaster spec. But it did not end up pulling the other dwarves so no worries about accidentally killing anything. Now if you are coming out here on a character that is not max level, what I would suggest is ice trapping Crystal Fang, taking care of the dwarves, and then taming Crystal Fang. That way you don't accidentally kill him. Now Crystal Fang's specialization is cunning. Its tamed abilities are bite, solid shield, growl, and dash, and its diet is meat, fish, raw meat, and raw fish. Now because Crystal Fang is an exotic pet, it has the specialization of Shimmering Shale, reduces magic damage taken by 30. Not too bad. Crystal Fang also has Solid Shell, which has a one minute cooldown timer. The Shell Beast hardens its rocky armor, reducing damage taken by 50% for 12 seconds. So not bad for a tanking pet. And that's it. That's how you get Crystal Fang for yourself. Not too shabby. And it makes me quite happy to have something actually quite pretty. I actually really enjoy its purple pink hue, but you know, that might just be a me thing. Well, if you enjoy this video, please consider giving it a like. And if you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I make hunter pet videos every week and I would love to have you here. Well, I look forward to seeing you in the next hunter pet video. Bye for now.